First, in a different video, I've gone over how to use the edge of one hand. So in this video, I'm going to start with the edge of one hand, and then we'll use the two edges of the two hands. So strikes with two hands, on, uh, focused on the edges of the hands. So if I'm talking to someone, and he gives me an indication that he's going to start a fight with me, and I've made up my mind that I'm going to stop him, and I want to do this in a submission way. To begin with, I can, as I move, I'm going to position my hand this way and strike him. So I'm going to do it fast and then point me chokehold. Now, I'm not advocating for chokehold because we know that if you're not really good at it and you don't control it, you're going to hurt the other person. And this lesson plan is not about chokehold. But I'm just giving you an idea of how you can stop this. Or I can simply turn him around and drop him backwards. And if he's not ready, he falls backwards, he can get hurt. So the bottom line is we don't want to do too much damage, but we just want to stop this before I, as a defender, get injured. So he gives me an indication he's going to do something. I turn him around, grab him, and throw him down. So that's the use of one edge. Now, for the use of two edges, I'm going to ask him to grab a kicking bat. So at this point, I'm standing here, and he gives me an indication that he wants to fight. For whatever reason, he throws a punch. I go back. Now, I can move forward using front stance and do this technique. Or I can bring both my legs together in a crossing uh, uh, X fashion and then push them forwards. So again, I can use it in front stance and my thought process is I'm going to go to this person and the arms are the extension of my energy moving forwards. Or from here, I'm going to crisscross my legs and, and if, if I drop down and lock my knees, transfer the energy, that's the effect I'm going to get. So perhaps this may not stop the fight, but it may give him a chance to say, do I really want to pick a fight with this guy? He seems to know something. And you haven't given too much of what you can do away. So this shock to the body can maybe make the other person realize, hey, maybe I should just walk away. And that's the lesson plan for today. Peace.